Hi, I'm Anya. Welcome to my kitchen. Today I would like to share with you a recipe for raw soup. This is an amazing soup. It's a chicken and noodle soup and it is really, really delicious. I think it's a very nice comfort soup and you should give it a try. In case you decide to do that, let's have a look at the ingredients so you know what you need. I'm starting with my chicken. I washed it thoroughly and right now I'm transferring it to a large pot and covering it with cold water. I'm going to be cooking my chicken. It will take around half an hour until we get all that ugly foam on top. We're going to clean it. Well, at least as much as we can. When our stock is clean, we're going to add all the vegetables. At the end, I'm adding the onion. As you can see, I'm keeping the skin on. It will give that beautiful color to our rosso. Then I'm adding bay leaves, peppercorns, and old spice. I'm going to be cooking it on a low heat for two hours. In the meantime, if I'm getting the foam again, I'm going to clean it. After two hours, I'm going to add two teaspoons of salt and then a bunch of freshly washed parsley. I'm going to be cooking it for another half an hour now and then I'm going to fish out my chicken and onion. I'm going to save it for another recipe. Then I'm fishing out the carrots. I'm going to be using them for serving my rosso. Then I'm lining my strainer with a cheesecloth and I'm going to strain my soup. I really want to have a clean rosso. And I'm picking up the carrots I missed before. And our soup is ready now, so it's time for the noodles. I'm going to be cooking them according to the instructions, but uh, it was one teaspoon of salt in the boiling water, then we're adding the noodles, we're giving them a stir so they don't get stuck to the bottom of the pot. And I think for me it was 10 minutes of cooking. Now when the noodles are ready, we can serve the soup. So we start with the noodles, then we cut our carrots in a coin size, putting on top of noodles, and then pouring the soup over. Now we need some freshly ground pepper and chopped fresh parsley. And that's it, the soup is ready. Now you have some chicken left over to use for some other recipe. And I will give you some ideas. I will have a recipe for uh, chicken pierogi coming soon. So you can use that chicken for this recipe. I hope you enjoyed the movie. As usually, let me know what you think. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.